So hi again. Uh, today we will do some vegetable food. So what you will need is cabbage, onion, carrot, some parsley. We will do something like vegetable rostis or pancakes, as you will say. And for this we will use it as well some milk, eggs, and a little bit of farina, uh, flour. And for on the top we will do roasted courgette. We got it nice, small. Roasted courgette and cherry tomato and some herb salad. It's gonna be on the top, so let's start. So right now we grated uh, some carrots, sliced onion and cabbage. But you can use any kind of vegetable. You can use carrot, sweet potato, courgette, aubergine, anything but you or pumpkin. Pumpkin is very nice, sweet. Today I have a cabbage because I like cabbage. It's, it's nice, sweet and it's actually very healthy for stomach. And I will chop some sauce, uh, parsley as well into it. So give a nice mix and as well then uh, seasoning salt and I will show you then more. So for seasoning I have here grounded ginger from Morocco. So I put it in just to get a nice taste. You can you can use fresh ginger, but I don't have it right now because I used it last time for nice fresh juice. So, a bit of coriander. So you can make them the same way, like a little bit aromatic, you can use anything. Salt, I use the sea salt. And you just mix them. You see how beautiful, colorful it is. It looks like a coleslaw. But this is gonna be different. So for the next one, it's we have to add on to the to this mixture. We have to add on something that will hold it on together. So we will go for around 400, 400 milliliter of milk, maybe less. Is everything up to the amount? Amount what you have it. Then we will do. Two eggs. Long time I didn't do the eggs with one hand, but it's still working. And a uh, little bit of soya. But you don't have to do it the same way. And then it's coming as well farina. It means flour. Normal flour and so you will just mix it and I will show you. you see how the consistency is so we use you see how many maybe 200 gram of flour it's not that much just give big whisk and then you pour it in the mixture so you see now the mixer Right, hold it together. Now we can do the roasting of the pan, then we will prepare the salad. So the pan is ready, heat it up. And now we can continue on. So now we can continue on the salad. You see, they are very young. Nice. Something like this. When it's too big like this one, you can still cut it like half. And you can combine these as well, this salad or the rostis as well with a with cheese if you like it. And uh, with cheese for meat eaters, 
So you can put it on as well some meat, you know, like roast chicken or even sausages. But I like it only this way. So in this cooler later on we will just roast it with some onion. So you can you can you put it on to see how is it moving. I like this pan. We put some veg uh, olive oil. This one again, olive oil, and we just leave it roasted, you know, like this, and then we just flip it, and then we'll be ready. Just take it out, and then on the top we will put, serve it with a with a salad. How beautiful! And you can use even as well the coconut oil for cooking. You can get nice taste. So we just cook it. We prepare another pan for the for the for the salad. So when we cook it, we pour it. We put this the salad. We bring it to the salad and we cook it. So with this one is ready. If you don't like big one, you can do it small one. But we three, we fit three in one pan. We just cook it. So now we can prepare the salad. Just half. If you want to need to do it quickly, you can take a few. Then you will do it. You see? Then you pour it at the same time. So another time, I can cut it like this. So we flip them, see they look nice, put some salt, a little bit of olive oil, and I grated some zest from one lemon, it's gonna get beautiful taste, the courgette and lemon is amazing, and we will season it by olive oil, salt, and lemon juice, and salt, uh, parsley. It's all about beer. So we do it different, more. Uh, we switch it off and we transfer it in here. So the salad is ready. We just put. A little bit of olive oil, salt, and lemon juice and parsley. Just like that. And whenever you do it with the salad, you can do it the same way. If you, if you like to have some sweet little bit inside, I recommend it you. You can do it the same way. If you like to have some sweet little bit inside, I recommend you use the honey. Honey because of the sugar is not that healthy. So it's better when we use the honey instead. But I like to use only salt lemon and olive oil that's it so it's time for plating and you have nice and easy you can see nice and easy vegetarian dish within a few minutes it's not that complicated